Hello everybody, today we are going to start a new world and it's called How to Minecraft. I'm going to tell all of you on, tell all of you how to play Minecraft properly without a bonus chest and stuff like that. But you're, this is an optional thing really, you can do full inventory if you really want to. It doesn't matter about that, but it's also the cheats, his bonus chest. So, first, when you come in your world, you if you're on PS4, press keep on holding R2 to mine. You have to keep on pressing R2 to mine. And if you want to, and those are just, that's one of the basics. Another basic, place, L2, if you're on PS4 to place. R2 to mine again. And another basic inventory is that you open your inventory, that's triangle. And square is crafting. Oh yeah, I forgot from my uh, from my other world, my main world, I forgot to turn it back back to normal crafting. I need to turn it back to normal crafting. I can only really use normal crafting for like uh loads of stuff but signs I don't really I can't really find it on normal crafting I have to turn it to classic crafting hmm come on aha classic crafting is on classic crafting right now so when you go on square comes to this We that's weapons you can make Lee and now this is how you create you need a have that to create a chest. I mean, not a chest, but a crafting table. So you use that, sorry, and then you can go into your crafting table that's right here. And then you have a crafting table in the end. Place it down using L2, and now you can craft even more things now. And weapons, you can actually craft a weapon and stuff. Now, this is my idea. Get, definitely get an axe and a pickaxe. An axe and a pickaxe. You are going to want an axe and a pickaxe. Axe, it takes forever to mine if you're just using your fist. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's birch. Mm -hmm. Takes forever for you to mine with your fist. But with an axe, it takes slightly quick. It's slightly quicker. Now this is how fast you can mine. I mean, yeah, get to wood. Now that's a bit faster. Now you can mine it's a lot faster now. And the reason why you're going to want a pickaxe is because, so you can go mining, that's the only way how you can first go mining. You always have to get a wooden pickaxe in first. It's because without a wooden pickaxe you can't mine stone to get a stone pickaxe. And then uh, with stone, mine to get the st iron. And then with the iron, you can actually mine to get diamonds. That's what you're really going to want. So now, now this is for starters. Instead, this is a way how you can sprint. So, with uh, with L3, that's the joystick that has L on the side. Left joystick. So, you go forwards once. So, uh, so like this, forwards really quickly, and then you tap it. And then you make it go for the you push the choice joystick twice. So let me do it. So to push it twice. One two. Wait no. One two. Did he hear that? Did he hear the tap? One two. That's all you need to do. And if you want to go up, if you want to see up, use the R three and make it go forwards to the side. Make it go to the side and left and down make the joystick go down now you've sort of completed uh, the basics now now you're going to want to actually get into the real part of minecraft now let's go and find now first you're going to want to get food let's go and get some food i mean no not food kill three sheep would your, be your first target to kill three sheep it's because you need that to make a bed Uh, and oh yeah, and this is something. This isn't a basic thing. 
but if you jump whilst attacking the animal, it will make it take damage. And if you know it takes more damage, I mean, yeah, more damage. If you know it takes more damage, no, that didn't make it take damage. That made it take damage, but at critical, you have to jump. So, if you do critical, stars will come out of it. So, ah, uh, stop, uh, I've got seeds. Stars will come out. Yeah, did you see that? Stars came out of it. Now let's kill this thing off. There we go. Oh, that's unlucky. I want you to get something now. We need to find our third sheep. That's all we... <gasps> Another sheep. Now, sprint. Okay, I'm going to try and punch a sheep so it goes back to the shore. Okay, it's back on the shore. That's what you want to do if something goes into the shore because then it can drop and then fall in the water and then you can't find it. Yay! Now we have three pieces of wool. Now we can happily make a bed and you need any free any plank in the bottom if you're doing so if you're doing classic free wool on top and uh, any plank any free plank on the bottom now we can make this a bed you can only use it when you are when it's night time you can only use it when it's night time now let's go and mine this up now time to get to the real real parts of minecraft find just find some wood i mean not the wood but find a cave you're going to want to find a cave or just get food first. Do you actually mind it? Get food. Come on, stupid cow. So, oh, by the way, sheep have eight health points, but cows have ten. More. Ooh. Now we have plenty of food. Now, if your hunger bar gets lower like this, for well, mine from now, you're going to eat something to regain it. If it's on, if you've lost one bit of the bar, or a half, or no, none, you can heal if you, you uh, took damage. So, let me take damage. Let me run around a bit so I have one and a half hunger. One and a half. Okay, I have one and a half now. Now, if I jump from a high point, I won't heal, right? Now, eat something. And now it's up to four. Now it can heal. See how that works? And it, when you get up to the last heart, it's, you heal slowly. Now, let's get to mining. Coal. That's what you really want to make torches. And you can make charcoal just in case you have bad luck uh, getting coal. So I'll show you on how to get charcoal in a minute after I've mined this coal up. Oh yeah, and if you find an ore, look around the same area and then you can actually find that same ore again. Just look around the area. Hello, Mr. Sheep. Now let's look around the area. There isn't really anything. Let's look down. The below us. Yep, can't really find any more coal. So we have free coal. Now let's turn it to torch. Torches. Let's just. So do we have any sticks? Nope. Well, I have no problem with that. More sticks. Now we can make this. So that's charcoal and this is coal. Get your coal and you can get four torches every time. Now let's go and tr let's try and make uh, so we could get charcoal instead. Just to tell you how you can guess if you have bad luck getting coal. So, uh, yep, I have enough to make a furnace. Let's make a furnace. Oop, it seems like it's getting dark. Let's place down a bed. 
but we still weren't able to go on it yet. See, it's still not nice, still not dark enough. So let's just craft the furnace we need. So, and all you need, oh wait, it's eight stone, eight cobblestone to make a furnace. So all you need to do if you're doing classic crafting is just get, just put cobblestone all around it. Now let's take it. Now we have this. So now we can make charcoal, but I think it's good enough. So now we can go to sleep, I think. Yep, now we're going to sleep. Now, if you want to get out, press L2 if you want to get out. L2. L2. Okay, now let's actually sleep properly. Oh, it's a good morning now. It should be morning. And then line up your bed. And now we've just got a furnace. So if you, I don't really remember how you make a charcoal. Is it this? I think it's this on how you make charcoal. Oh yeah, it's uh, and then the charcoal should spawn there rapidly. Not rapidly actually. But see charcoal. We have charcoal. Now don't get rid of all of your wood. Okay, I think that's enough. Don't burn that, please. So, now we have a bit of charcoal. So you can do this in case you have bad luck getting coal. So charcoal, you can use it to get torches. So charcoal, and that's coal. Charcoal, you'll still get four torches. but And they're still the same, but that's just another way of getting torches, just in case you can't, if you have bad luck getting any coal. You could do it this way. Now let's go off. So now you're up to the parts you might want to start making your shelter. So you could do it out of stone, stone or wood. But I'll, if if I was you, I'll go for stone. Even though you have to use a pickaxe, I'll go for stone in cases like lightning. It could strike your house and it could burn. Let me just eat this. Yeah, and it can burn, and you won't like that. And if you have any more wood materials in there, they, they'll get burnt as well. So you should use stone, because the fire will just go out. So let's just use this. It's just get enough to make a house out of stone. Cobblestone, I meant. <sighs> You can make your house anywhere, but you might want to actually put on a, a flat surface because then it's, your job will be easier. Now, we have some stone. Now, of course, that won't be enough to make a little house, but let's just start making it. We don't. This is just how to Minecraft this thing is. So you don't actually need a big one because I'm not actually going to do this thing forever. This is only just to help you in case you're like a beginner at Minecraft and you don't know that much stuff. Except from like how to make wood tools and that's it. Okay. Just get more of this. Now let's start. Make it about smallest. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And of course you're going to want a doorway. Door, the doors are only two blocks high. Uh, so whilst you're making a house you might want to have a gap. Let's just do this. Oh, we've run out of stone. Let me just go and get some more. Now, right now I'm sprinting, remember. Uh, see? One, two. And you could jump if you want to. And if you're jumping at the same time sprinting, you'll go even faster than just a normal sprint. Now let's collect some of this stone. Hey, was that gravel? Oh yeah, if you're having gravel, you want to use a shovel. 
Um, let's get this. Oh, I, my pickaxe is broke. Melantorori. Oh yeah, I can make a stone pickaxe right now. Where's the doorway? Where is it? Oh, it's right there. Stone pickaxe, I'll just put my bed here. Now let's make a stone pickaxe. Don't have the material. Oh wait, I'm not trying to make... There we go, we have a stone pickaxe. With the stone pickaxe, you can mine iron. Now, more materials if you upgrade. So let's... And also you can mine this stone a lot, a way faster. Hmm. have 19 cobblestone. Might just need a bit more. No stupid gravel. Oh yeah, I hate you gravel. Oh yeah, this is something you want to worry about gravel and sand. So if you get, let me just do this for example. Uh, so I'm running. See, it can actually suffocate you. Did he just take me to take? Did he just see me take damage? It can actually kill you. If you stay in there long enough. Is there a pig in there? Oh, it must have just came and I thought it just spawned there. Well, if you find a pig inside your house. Ta-da. Hmm. There we go. I forgot pork chop doesn't do that much if it's raw. Is that all? Hmm. Hmm. Just give it something. Just give it something, okay? Oh, wait, can you even give it stuff? No. Is that an enderman? No. And you can't even give it to them. Well, you want to get a wolf, you need to let it turn to night time, and then you can kill skeletons and get their bones. I mean, speaking of which, I should get a sword. Now let's get to our stone sword. Now we've upgraded on weapon, as you know, that's our first weapon. Now you can do, instead of, you can do now five damage. A wooden sword only does four damage. So this does more. And how many shots to kill a pig? Well, you've asked a white question. Ah. Two shots. Including extra damage, still two shots. Just kidding, I was actually doing extra damage. Oh, you want to know what happens when you kill a horse? So these are uh, its droppings. Come on. Nah! Just want... So it should have leather normally when you kill a horse. Oh, nothing. Oh, little wolfies. Hello. Hello. Oh, cute wolf. If you find a wolf and you want to tame it, just do this simply. No, I hate you. <laughs> just put, if you want to have like a a wolf but you don't have any bones simply you could just put stone around it and let's let me just show you let me just get you on a flat surface and just try and show you how you do it oh hard 
Oh, you're a cute little wolf. But I have to do this. Okay, so you can do that if you really want to get a wolf, but you don't have any bones. And that's what we're going to do. Keep this wolf until night, and then we'll attack a skeleton, and we should get its bones. So that's what that is for. And let me just remember it's over there. So you could tame a wolf, just to show you. And I could tell you the simple controls for a wolf. Well, I'm breaking the bed. So, now let's continue making more of this. You want to at least to lowest three blocks high. It's because one ceiling, one block to the ceiling, and two blocks to put you inside. But you could have an open roof if you if you want to. It doesn't mean you have to do, do a roof. You can do it if you want. But that's all I'm saying. I advise you should do a roof in case it's like lightning and it could kill you, strike you. Now, let's put some torches in here. And it's going to be night time soon. Let's put some here. I think it will be night time. And I could happily get a cute little wolf. Advice. Let me just show you some advice. So, you, any, so if you don't want anything to spawn, any like googlies and stuff, to spawn around your house, put torches around your house. So it'd be unlikely for any to be close. Now it's time to kill some skellies. That's all we need just to get one simple wolf. And one cute wolf. Oh and by the way. Let me just check just in case just to see where the wolf is just in case it hasn't despawned. You have to stay near it for it to not despawn. Yep, and it hasn't despawned. Oh, I can see a spider because there's some red. What is that? Oh, that's a horse. I thought that was a skeleton. Hmm. Yep, and I can hear horse. And I can hear a simple little cute wolf. Come on. Any skeletons? Anywhere? Don't go too far or your wolf could despawn. Come on, have some food out, definitely. Let's go around our house, because around you, Google can spawn and chase you. There isn't really anything. <gasps> Skeleton. Okay. It's in the water. Ouch. Oh, where are you? <gasps> when do they make you so hard to kill? Okay, they are very hard to kill, no matter what. If you're a professional, what was that? I'm sure that was a control to eat that. Okay. Full health, skeleton nearby, 
full health and deadly skeleton. Let me just go through him again. He is so deadly. Haha, <laughs> I missed. Come on. Give up. Why is he so hard? I know, go in the water. Attack him from above. Come on, did I get his bones? Nope. Okay, get out. No, no. Oh, my. Did he just see that? Oh, I knew it was a zombie. Well, anyway, I died. Please don't say that wolf has despawned. So I died. Now, the trick with skeletons is, I mean, enemon is don't look them in the eye. If you do, look. It will start attacking you. What was that? Oh. Now, let's kill her. Oh, by the way, Enderman do attack of a diamond sword. If you have the Ender Pearl, this is a trick with skeletons. If you have an Ender Pearl, you are going to want to do this. Teleport. Even though it makes you take damage. Hey, right scale. Okay. Hate it. Just cuss. <gasps> Did I get his? Where are the bones going? Okay, I think I'm gonna die again. Now let's try and find some skeletons that are actually on land. These that can do the trick. Let me. Oh my god, a creeper. Don't, don't. Oh my god. I was going to about to save a trick to kill a creeper. The trick to kill a creeper is to. How to Minecraft? How to Minecraft? How to Minecraft? Good. All I need is one simple scale letter. Oh, easy. Lemon squeeze it. Just check, just to see if the wolf is still there. Please. Is that wolf gone? Oh, it's gone. Isn't that terrible? Hmm, that was very terrible. Now, let's just go to sleep now. And I think I'll be ending the episode of How to Minecraft. Okay, I think it's going to be the end of How to Minecraft now. See you later. Bye!